hi guys and welcome to another video so in this video today i'll be sharing my green card journey or my green card iyo ku apply queen na ivo sasa so yeah let's get into this video so i applied in 2018 and uh, between october and november up or in between there and i remember i was in school i was in campus so after applying you're told that the results are going to be out the next year may so in between 20 in between applying october and 2019 may i graduated from cooperative university of kenya i tamagd Well, immediately you don't get jobs immediately so I, I stayed January Feb March was it still March I think March mwisho ama March in between hapo hivyo ndo nikaitiwa kazi ya huduma namba so I did we went for train for huduma namba and by the time the results were being announced ama no not being announced sorry by the time results zilikuwa zinatoka which is may the first week in between there i was doing huduma number and something weird or something funny is that i wasn't even interested in looking to go and check put in my confirmation number and see if i won so i stayed for the whole of that month and i remember that day when i went into that website and put in my confirmation number it was may 30th May 30th ndo nikaenda nikaeka hiyo confirmation number. We, nikafata congratulations. Naka congratulations you have been selected for father something DV lottery blah 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 blah. Whoa. But I tell you I was so we were so happy. And let me tell you I applied for the first time. Ile tu ile tu nasema ah mi acha tu niende tu nikajaribu hii kitu watu ushinda wakiongelelea acha tu niende nika apply and i applied ivo tu and wa ngajipata nime win so anyone who is there mwenye amekaa tu ama anasema ah hiyo kitu ni ya watu specific hapana si ya watu specific as in haibagui ha, hata kidogo ni lottery so wewe ukijaribu tu ndivyo twin 2019 May 30th and the whole of that year now I've, I've learned that I won and I know this process needs money so nafaa kuwa either niko na savings ama niko na job ama family yangu apo na pesa na uvicha tu kuwa nazo because that process it's not cheap it might be cheap to other people but to us I kwa cheap hata kidogo so we had to go above and beyond kutafuta hiyo pesa and I do remember I started in that year 2019 nikaanza kufanya promotions zile promotions za ma supermarket i did those i also used to go to gikomba na chukua matishu na 5050 alafu na kuja na uzambia 100 i also used to go to isili na buy maboxa ma alafu tunazungushia watu wenye tunajua na wengine wenye watujui i hustled from then from may 30th 2019 the whole of 2020 so many things were going so wrong first the first thing they will tell you or how they will communicate to you after you are born it's emails they will ask you for supporting documents na anything else i went to neck you're told to go to neck you, they verify your certificate that it's a legit certificate finish up with neck you do medical medical they do all those scans on your body tb unadungwa masindano huku and then what else do they do Yeah I think that's all. Yeah I think you too ndo nakumbuka. So after that you go to the US embassy. Woo. Eh hey, that's a tense one. Woo ilikuwa moto. Just ji kama ni hiyo mentality ya US embassy. Unasikia tu jina yenyewe uko. Woo. Unasikia tu nikaona tetemeka ama ndo ama unasikia kawoga flani. My interview was the 7 a.m. So I had to wake up around 4 got prepared fika to Nairobi i think it's 45 minutes ama 30 kulingana na jam so i, I went to tao nikachukua gari all along i'm alone because 
if you have somebody, somebody to accompany you at a half kuka uko nje kwa gate so niko tu peke yangu so nikaenda and then tulikuwa watu kwa line kama i think tulikuwa between 10 to 15 in between hapo we go through the first security gate the second and then the third one akwambia sasa kwenye utaenda ni nini hivyo so you are there tensing and all that and then so i went in kuna kuko wako so modest walikuwa tu wameva wako tu warembo wanakaa tu poor and then i was guided to the teller nikaambiwa kwenye nitalipia na cash nikapeana cash kwa kashia and then nikaambiwa ni ngoje hapo hivyo teller mwenye sasa anaendeleza maswali huh saa hizo ni mzungu na kuuliza maswali so at first I was like kai mimi nitamsikia kenya anasema but then anyway, you nikasema and then they somehow ni kama they they sense fear somehow ama aki sense kuna fear fulani atajua itam trigger kukuuliza swali maybe ama maswali mob ama swali yenye somehow hauko shua hauko shua jibu so mimi nikasema ah unaji unaji tab to so i went there and she asked for my documents yeah, i think i asked for documents passport Nikampatia. And then the question that she kept on asking me is, What are you going to do in the US? So I'm going to study and work. For the, fa the first time, I was going to study and work. And then I was going to somehow. I was going to study. So in, in my mind, at first, when I was like, huh? Okay, I'm serious. But still, inside me, I was somehow scared. Somehow, catension. Let's just say my kulkona some catension. She's scared. So, nkamwambia, I'm going to study and also to work. And then she went on to ask about post information. Nkamwambia, I want to know what does your host do? Blah blah blah. Nkamwambia. And then she asked me the same same question again. What did you say you are going to do in the US? Nkamwambia to study and also to work. And then here is the here is the twist now. So she asked me, so how are you going to fund for your studies? And then something just came kwa kili. So nika mwambia, and then she was like, oh, okay, that's nice. That's good. Ooh, and then she continued to say, okay, I, I will I will approve your visa. Now when I tell you, mimi si kusikia anything else alisema after apple. I think I lino for like five minutes, five minutes, like in Akiliangu ili shot. Ili shot two once. Na jual yongianga afterwards after I say, I'm going to approve your visa, but my mind went. Ili fungika kabisa, ili fungika nika fungika. Siju anything I ambia afterwards, but na kumuka ni kitoka, and then apoko mlango na uliza nivo. Ani ambia eh. Nka uliza ukoshua. Kani ambia, yeah, it's true, it's. It's done, Nivo. Unezenda home, utangode. Your documents will be sent to DHL and they are going to email you, blah, 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 Evo. And that's how my green card journey went to a point of having now the visa approved and finally managed to enter, I'm to come to the US. Yeah. So thank you for watching this video and bye.